forms of exercise and, and honestly I have tried quite a few of them but I still haven't even explored so many you know things like I really want to get into swimming I love swimming but there are a few factors that I think oh I don't like the water I don't like the chlorine I don't want to have to shower I make all of these excuses as to why I'm not going to go swimming my point in saying that is that we always are going to find an excuse as to why you're not gonna engage in a certain type of activity. In general, as long as you are engaging in some sort of activity, you're doing yourself a great service. The number one thing when it comes to forget, like, totally forget weight loss, and I know I talk about that a lot, but forget that. The number one thing for health overall, like sleep, stress, mood, digestion, all of those things, it's, it's activity. It's actually just moving that body, burning some calories, revitalizing your cells, getting blood flowing. These are the reasons why I always encourage activity. And it's not, you know, I'm not sitting here and telling you what to do. I'm just trying to create some benefits for you because you will see in your life, if you go ahead and wake up in the morning, take a 20 minute walk. If you have a pet, that's an awesome way to automatically get in some activity. Instead of letting your pet out in the backyard, which I've slowly started to do lately my Yourself, get out there and take them for a walk because you know what that connection that you'll have with your pet is so much better and it'll get you moving as well and or in the evening if you come home and you have a little bit of time get out for a walk or if you have some equipment at home five minutes don't look at that as a waste look at that as a beginning looking look at that as a routine that you're starting to implement and eventually you'll start to get a little bit more intrigued by other activities by other forms so for example I do a lot of yoga um, and I really really encourage yoga for the benefits of relaxation for stress and just actually it's incredible for focusing your mind on something and it's something that you can actually elaborate into the rest of your life but that yoga isn't the only thing that offers that every form of activity always pushes you I heard this thing that Will Smith said recently and it was um, running life the two secrets really are running and reading and I'm going to focus just on the running part because he makes such a good point and it's that when you're running and I do this all the time. When I'm running and I'm tired or I feel like I can't run anymore, well, it's pretty much over. Like, I, I call it quits and I'm like so proud of myself that I've done and then I just ex can't wait to the next day that I can push myself like that. But what if, what if I pushed myself past that point and kept on going? I would have to overcome all of the voices that are telling me that I'm tired, that my legs hurt, that I have to get back to go do some sort of work that I have, like all of these things are all limitations, they're all excuses as to why I'm not continuing to run. But if I actually just let those go and push past it, I push past a lot of barriers that, that are actually not just about running anymore, they're about overall in life that I can apply. So the reason I, I bring all of these random points together is because I'm trying to, to show you that if you are interested in, in pushing yourself in, in, in any form of exercise or activity, go for it. You know, Don't worry about any health conditions or any health restrictions because a lot of the times we can actually improve a lot of conditions through activity. And it, you got to start gentle. But once you get going, don't be afraid to push your limit. You know, it's, it's an awesome way to... It's an awesome way to grow and to improve your health. And if you want to do yoga, go for it. But don't just do yoga. Go for a run. If you want, if you always go running, go try some weights for a while. You know, CrossFit is becoming huge, and I actually really recommend it. I'm looking to get into it myself. I think it's it's an awesome way to do an all over body workout. Um, and you know, but that's just my opinion. But um, anyway. My point is that when you get into activity, it can be so much more than weight loss. It can be an entire revolution of your health. And, and that's really what it's all about. So if you're thinking about trying something, just even just read into it. That's what you do is just read into it and then start to feed that interest. And that's what's going to get you out the door anyway. So have a good summer. Enjoy this beautiful weather. There's a lot of activity that you can do out there. The summer is awesome right now in Vancouver.
So we'll see you next time. But uh, again, just don't forget, be active for more than one reason. Be active for, for every reason that you can think of. It, it'll benefit you. Thank you. Bye.